Okay, here we are. This is the uh, Nexus 7 in its box. Let's take a look. And inside that quite small box to start with is an even smaller box. And let's have a look at this. How easy or otherwise is this to take apart? Not particularly. In fact, I think it's designed to be childproof. There you go. So, put that to one side. Here we have the uh, the Nexus box, and inside that we have the actual Nexus. Okay, first impressions. Incredibly thin. There it is. It's light. In fact, it weighs almost nothing. So, what do you get inside the box? Put that to one side. And the answer to that question is very little. You get your power supply in pieces. And that is it. So we get the UK plug, we get the instructions, we get what looks like a micro uh, micro USB connector and by the look of it one simply slots that into there and there you have as you can see it's Asus one um, Power supply, one warranty, and one quick start guide, which as you can see is not much to it. It's all in English, which is good. Yep. All right, so let's look at the Nexus itself. To describe it as beautiful would be an understatement. It's another piece of plastic to come off there. And as it, so it's a soft kind of rubbery finish. Um, speaker at the back. Power. Standard headphone socket. volume that's probably the on-off switch and that's basically it so as you can see not a lot there I'm suspecting that that little hole there is the microphone so let's turn it on comes up Google I'm guessing this will take a little longer than normal because this is its first uh, time on. As you can see the display is incredibly clear. And there we have it. Welcome English United States. Let's just see if we can change that. 
English United Kingdom. Uh, initial impression is the um, touchpad works incredibly smoothly. United Kingdom. And I'm guessing press go. Select Wi Fi. That's a good start. We'll uh, just put the Wi Fi information in. So that comes up asking for the Wi Fi with a fairly standard looking keyboard. Again, um, the feel of it is very much like an iPad. So now it knows about the tablet is connecting to Wi Fi. Got Google. Do you have a Google account? Yes, I do. Email. Apart from the slightly smaller keyboard, it uh, feels again just like using the iPad. It's signing in, apparently. Tablet is contacting Google. Google's location services. Setup complete. Start shopping for free. You now have fifteen pounds to spend in the Google Play Store. Well, that's a good start. Tablet is set up and ready to use. Okay, so uh, there it is. Uh, let's try. Uh, this is obviously Google uh, Chrome. You'll see up at the top there the little speech uh, thing. One of the features of the device. Let's give that a shot. How far is it from Newcastle to London? And there is a map of Newcastle to London. Now remember this was a sealed box, I've never used this before. That's really not bad. Um, I have to say the touch sensitivity is superb.